Hey everyone, so this is my second progress report on the building of my forge. And here's what I've gotten done so far. It's really, really heavy. Well, not really, really heavy, but pretty heavy. And I've gotten the angle irons that I said that I was talking about before on. I've bolted those on. I've got the hinged panel on. As you can see, that's wiggling nicely. And I've gotten the legs on as well, which fold down like so. And now that I've got them folded down, I can stand it up. But first I have to pick the darn thing up, which is a bit of a challenge. Get the legs back down. stand up, as you can see. And, um, well, I've still got a bit more work to do. I'm going to be taking it to school tomorrow to get some holes drilled in it, because the, hole, the drills that I have here uh, in the right size are not tough enough to cut the steel. So I'm going to take this to school and get it drilled there. And then I'm going to be able to attach the pipe to the bottom. This pipe, it will go like so, but it'll actually be underneath. So rather than like that, it'll actually be like this. And then it'll be bolted on there. And I'm probably going to put some more braces on the legs to make sure it doesn't fall over, because it is a little bit unstable as it is. I'm going to be using it primarily outside where I'll be able to just dig it into the soil, which will give it a bit more stability, but still, I want to make it as stable as I can, even on hard surfaces. And, okay, besides, um, besides getting the pipe on, I still need to make the panels to go on the sides here and here. Those are what are going to lock this in place whenever, I've, whenever I have the forge in operation. And once I get those plates on and the tube and attach the fan to it, whenever I get a fan, I will theoretically be able to start using the forge, for which I have bought two 20-pound bags of lump charcoal, which <clears throat> you're not supposed to use the briquettes. That's why I'm using this 100% all-natural hardwood lump charcoal. I don't know exactly how it's different. I haven't opened the bags yet. But I've got two of them, two 20 pound bags. So that should be enough at least to get me started. Uh, I have no idea how much this thing is going to burn whenever I get it going. I'll have to do a bunch of experimentation with it. How to get it to different heats and stuff like that. But it's coming along and I'm having a great time. Um, I guess I'll have another progress report whenever I've got another bit of it finished. So, um, yeah, that's about it for now. Have a great day.